Hey guys, it's Lillian. So I'm just coming to you with my January favorites and I have a mixture of things from makeup to winter wear to music. So I'm going to start off with makeup. Um, there are two foundations I've been loving so far this year and they're or this January, I guess I could say this year as well. Um, yeah, there are two uh, uh, drugstore foundations. The first one is the Revlon Nearly Naked Foundation in Cappuccino, and it just looks like this. And um, I already have a review up on it, so I'll link it either here in the video or the bottom bar below. Maybe both, who knows. Um, but yeah, I've been really liking this. And the second drugstore foundation, which I'm wearing right now, is the CoverGirl at Outlast Stay Fabulous. 3-in-1 foundation um, with sunscreen. It's, it's SPF 20 and it's in the color Soft Sable. Um, I actually have some stuff to say about this. I think it's the same color as one of the colors in the Queen collection for CoverGirl. I don't remember the number but I will definitely put it um, in the products mentioned part of the bottom bar below. Um, next makeup item is another CoverGirl product. Is my um, CoverGirl Clean Oil Control Press Powder. It's in Tawny and it just looks like this. I've had this since last summer and um, it's done me well. I really like it and I would repurchase that. Um, a blush I've been liking is my Mary Kay Brick Brush Blush. <laughs> And um, it just looks like this. It's very neutral br brush. I feel like I can't talk, can't speak, but yeah, it's very neutral and I really like it. Um, another thing that I've been loving because um, it's been winter and my lips are just drier, like drier than usual. Um, the first thing is my Lush Bubblegum Lip Scrub. And I dropped this in my washroom and the cat broke, so I had to tape it together so yeah look how like weird that looks but this is what the product looks like and it tastes good and I really like it and after I put that on I apply my Burt's Bees uh, beeswax lip balm um, just looks like this it's the one that you put your hand in I'm not a fan of that but it's what I have so it's what I'm gonna use um, and the last lip product is my Maybelline color whisper lipstick and made it mauve and it just looks like this and I have a review up on this as well so I will link that either here in the video or the bottom bar below again maybe both <laughs> and then the last makeup related thing are well it's not really makeup it's a tool but it's just my Delium brushes um, I actually have five here that I used in my tutorial that I just filmed and yeah, so I really, really like these brushes. Um, they're great. I just, I love them. Um, so that's it for that. Um, next is winter wear. So if you live in Ontario, Toronto, Canada in general, um, you know it is freezing. Like we had today, there was a wind chill of minus 26, which is ridiculous. It hasn't been that cold here um, in Ontario in um, two or three years. I believe that's what they said on the news. So I've been doubling up when it comes to gloves. So the first glo of the first pair of gloves I'd wear are my uh, leather gloves from Danier Leather, and on top of that, I have my Canada gloves. They're a bit beat up, but they do the job. Um, I, I wear these over it. This is as patriotic as you'll see me on this channel. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so I'm joking. Um, but yeah, this has been keeping me warm and I absolutely love it. Um, another thing is my winter coat. And it's a bit big, so it probably won't fit in the whole frame. But it's just my TNA coat. Ooh, I'm dropping stuff. But it's my TNA coat from Aritzia. That's just the symbol. I've had this for about two or three years and it's brown and it's just long and then my scarf's in there. And also I've been really loving my Uggs. Those are downstairs though so yeah I'm not gonna get them. I'm pretty sure most of you know what Uggs are. And then another thing, this might be a little weird, are my skates, my figure skates. Um, I used to figure skate back in the day. Um, but yeah I've gone skating a couple times with my um, with my church and oh my skate it's ripped <laughs> oh well it still protects my skate but yeah so this is my skate they're just the Jackson skates just looks like that 
and um, I love them and they've all obviously come in handy for skating trips and then the last thing is music so I'll first show my Bridget Mendler CD I got this from my friend for Christmas and I'll just name off a couple songs that I absolutely love um, I, I love all of them but my three like my top three are forgot to laugh the chorus of that song love it amazing um, 515 and hold on for dear love those are my top three songs from that album and then I've been loving my new Hillsong album that I got it's their cornerstone album and it, there's 18 full songs on this so I don't think I'll have a top three I love all the songs but I'll see if I could do top five um, so I love Endless Light, Beneath the Waters I Will Rise, that's um, one song, Cornerstone, obviously that's the title track of this album, um, oh, this song's good too, I Surrender, Hope of the World, I love that song, uh, okay I'm going over five, I love Running, uh, Children of the Light, Stand in Awe, um, Love So High, and let, let's just stop there. So there you go. My 9 out of the, the 18 full songs. Um, yeah, so that was a lot. But it's an amazing album. If you haven't heard of Hillsong, they're just an Australian group from Australia. Duh. And uh, yeah, so I really, really love their album. I have like three or four of their albums. And um, yeah, they're an amazing band. So I hope you enjoyed my January favorites. And um, let me know what your favorites are for this month as well. Um, you could either put it in the comment below or video response. So just don't forget to like this video. Um, please comment and subscribe if you haven't already. Follow me on Instagram, uh, Facebook, and Twitter. And um, it's all under the same name. And I'll see you all in another video. Bye.